How you feeling, me? <laughs> yeah. Whoa! Good morning, sisters. You're shitheads! You're shitheads! Not what we thought. Children! Because I'm pregnant. No, it's a box full of virgin me. <laughs> wow. Ah. Welcome to your new virgin broadband kit. No, because it has you it's got. the thing. No, you can't. It's not meant to be taken out. That's not that, because they plug into there. But why else would it be on the wall? Because that's for it. That's a satellite thing for TV. Well, that's what it These says, though. TV. I don't see why it wouldn't. Uh. Welcome to Virgin Media. This video will take you through installing your broadband step by step. Hi everyone, I have literally no idea what the last clip of this vlog will be. I'm pretty sure it will be me and has setting up the Wi-Fi, but that was literally yesterday. It is now like five o'clock in the evening of the next day, Saturday today. I have been working all day. I literally have just got back from work. I left this morning at half past six. I've only just got back. So I'm gonna make myself some food. I wanted to continue this vlog because basically I wanted to continue it yesterday, but my battery died. My battery's flashing. Fuck. And if you haven't been following up with the vlogs, I left my camera charger at home. So I basically had to use hazards and I didn't like find hazards until late last night. So there was no point in like starting my vlog or like carrying on the vlog because I was literally getting in bed as my camera battery got put on charge. So that's the situation. I've now just finally had a chance to sit down and actually pick up my camera. We finally have Wi-Fi, which means that we're pretty much all set in the house. All we need to do is call the water company people and assign like our bank details to the water and then everything's literally sorted. Anyway, I am on my way back home from work. I went in and got some more coat hangers because if you remember in my last vlog I said there were a bunch of clothes that still needed hanging up but I'd run out of coat hangers so I went in the same shop just got some black ones. I also from work basically I did a lot of stock room stuff today which is like why I think I don't like didn't mind my shift as much because I weren't necessarily dealing with customers and stuff all the time which I've not got nothing wrong with dealing with customers like I don't mind it but it's just more ti like more tiring because you're constantly on your feet, being polite, being nice. Obviously, I always try and be polite whenever I can anyway. But you're like this, I don't know, if you work in retail, there's just an expectation of a shop person acting a certain way towards a customer, which is obviously you're trying to sell a product to them. And that normally tires me out like full stop. So the fact that I were in the stock room is which I, why I think I didn't mind it as much. But I saw this cup in the stock room. It's basically a fold away cup. Obviously, I really want to make a conscious effort of recycling and just doing things in order to like not waste as much. So I saw this cup and it's basically a reusable little cup like you'd get from Starbucks. But what's cool about it is, obviously you can put hot drinks, cold drinks in there. It's got a straw. So this is not the just one cool perk. It's like a rubber straw. Like I love chewing straws when I'm having a drink. I know it's really TMI, but I love like just biting down on a straw and I cannot wait. <laughs> it sounds so weird. Cannot wait to put some like juice or something in this and just chew the straw while I'm drinking it. So number one reason why I wanted to buy it. Number two, it's all black. Love that. We feel like we're like on Tumblr three years ago again. But then thirdly, it unscrews and if you pop this little thing off so you don't burn yourself, it pops. Wait, I've never done this before so I don't know. Oh, there we are. It pops down into a little tiny thing and obviously the straw like bends into there as well. So you can put the straw inside there, then you just put the lid on and it literally folds down into a tiny little thing like this and you can just put that in your bag.
up and then I'm gonna lay in bed and just chill for a little while. I feel like I've said that so many times in this clip, but I just thought I'd get the stuff that I need to do, i.e. hang my clothes out of the way before I start laying down because once I lay down, I just know I'm not gonna wanna get up. But I also wanna test this cup out, so I'm gonna make a cup of Bimp too, but first, it needs washing. <laughs> So you may be thinking, Byron, wow, it really looks like you've just been asleep for hours and you've just woke up. And I would reply to that, yes, hi, you're correct. In the last clip, I think I was doing my coat hangers in the last clip and that was hours ago. Um, I, like I said, we're going to get in bed and watch some YouTube videos. Surprise. <laughs> I did that, but I just fell asleep. Has is home from work now. She brought me some chocolate in and some food, so I've just eaten that. I'm so tired still, I don't even know why. I think it's literally just because I woke up so early this morning and then I've been out, obviously, at work all day. And I'm not used to waking up that early. Um, I went to bed relatively early last night, so like I still had a full night's sleep. But my body's just not used to being awake that early. Anyway, how's what I got from work? Oh yeah, the sippy cup thing. It's cool, isn't it? The straws rubber. Has. Hello? <laughs> Has is just buffering. Sorry. We'll be back in a second. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I know, yeah, it's rubber. I'll bite that though. Yeah, that's why I got it, because I want to bite it. I said that to my vlog earlier. <laughs> Don't fling my bean around my bed. Jeez, that's really fun. <laughs> Day 375 about seconds. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Look at that's Look back. Right. Wi-Fi's going why off now. Going off? <laughs> get in bed. I told you to get in bed an hour ago, so no. why are you not asleep? Don't turn the Wi-Fi off, I just want to watch friends! <laughs> Father Christmas won't come if you're still awake. Please don't turn <laughs> <laughs> I hate that so much. Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. So today is, oh no, it's the same vlog, what am I on about? Hi, continuation of yesterday's vlog. Um, I'm working again today and I really regret like agreeing to it. It's currently like half past ten in the morning. I have work at two, which is not too bad. At least like, I can just chill for the morning. But yeah, that's the situation. I'm just laid in bed. I'm going to watch some videos, wake up a little bit because as you can see by my eyes, I'm really freaking tired. Um, I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos and then I'm gonna get up, make myself some breakfast and just have a chill morning. I could do with filming a video, but like, I feel like I'm not gonna be able to get ready, set all my filming stuff up, film a video and then leave for work on time. So I might just film when I come back or I've got all day tomorrow to film. So I need to film at some point. I just wanna get filming sorted. I am so tired. I had such a weird dream last night. I had a dream that I died and it was my funeral. It was so weird. I was still alive like in person as in like my body was still able to walk around but I were dead and I could see everything that were happening but I weren't a ghost because other people could see me and like it was so weird. I had the like funeral at McDonald's and all my family and friends were gathered in McDonald's and it like connected to like a cemetery so I the, they were all waiting in like McDonald's waiting for me which was so freaking weird and then Megan were late to the funeral so me Ella and Maddie went and picked Megan up even though I'm the one dead and it's my funeral we went and picked Megan up and Ella were talking to me and stuff and I was crying in the back of the car and Ella was saying why are you crying I'm like because I'm dead all I did know is I was about to get in a coffin and um, have my own funeral, but thankfully I woke up. <laughs> that is such a weird dream, I don't even know why I dreamed that. It was so, so weird. <laughs> right, let's do this, let's get up. Can anyone guess what I'm going to have for my breakfast? I bet you can't, because I don't have it every single day. Um, I'm gonna have some Lucky Charms. I really want jam on toast, and you're currently like on top of the jam thing. Um, but I've not. I literally don't have any bread, so I can't. I just really want jam. Oh. Alright, so I literally have to leave for work like right now. I'm literally just putting some stuff in my bag and then I'm gonna head off. I can't find my wallet. I am just packing my bag like I said for work. I'm gonna head to work. Hopefully I'm not meant to be in and I can just 
wander on out when Haz is finished and we can leave and go home and um, all be well and good in the hood. Alright, so this is what I'm wearing today. I literally just have some tracksuit bottoms on, my comedy goss on, Converse, and then um, this shirt tucked in with a white t-shirt and then just my necklace. I don't even know if you can see that because the little bauble things. Then I just have my hat on as well, but this is the outfit. Like I said, I just put this tracksuit bottoms on, comedy goss on, Converse, and then the shirt. Pretty casual, but pretty, pretty cool. What does Lauren Gray call the viewers? Angels. Is it angels? Hi, good morning, angels. Um, you fucking can't. That's the um, type of viewership I'm actually aiming for. My target audience has changed to Lauren Gray, 15 year old fans. Um, or maybe like 12, actually. We'll lower that. So, hi, angels. Good morning. I hope your day is as good as your pussy. Um, can't wait to eat your ass later. I just woke up. And I'm feeling woke up, tick tock, what? Wake up in the morning feeling like P. Diddy. Let's go get breakfast, bitch. We have just been sorting some stuff out. Freya's actually going to accident in an emergency, so love that for you, sister. Um, my mum ordered us a microwave and some other bits, so I'm gonna do a little unboxing thing. I don't know where to put my camera. I think I'm gonna put it here. Oh, you can't even see through the light. Right, we're gonna do it here anyway. Um, I don't know which way up this should be, but my mum is a sweetheart and ordered us some stuff as a moving in present. Oh, yay! So, we uh, all have yeah. a thing for the bottom of the bed so you don't see the ugly mattress. We also have a sandwich toasty. Yeah! Food. I'm going to add cheese toasty. Love that. I mean, toaster. And then we have a quadruple toaster. That's actually so good. They're expensive to create. So, thanks for that, Mom. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Gail. We love you. Oh, that's so you, Mom. I like, thank you, Gail. We love a relationship. Alright, so the toaster's all set up. Mummy, if you're watching, this is the situation. We can't push it back to the wall yet, so it, it does look slightly forward because the thing's leaking. So we need to sort that out, and I don't want to push the toaster against the wall and it get, like, filled with water. But that's what it looks like there. Little tea station and toasty station. And then we've got the microwave all set up there. Ignore, obviously, the washing and stuff, but we just tied it up. Alright, so ignore my hair. It's literally so fluffy because I just washed in, like, there's nothing in it at the moment. But my mum got me a valance from my bed. I didn't even know that these things existed or at least I knew what they existed but I didn't know what they were called so she got me one if you don't know what it was like I didn't know the thing like this mattress underneath as you can see is like this like it's not really got like it's just like a mattress stand basically but I think it's so ugly and I'm so like obsessed with things looking nice so just to complete the aesthetic of my room I was like mum right I really just need to buy something to cover that up so my mum actually found one online just a white one and it just drapes over there so you can't see that ugliness I'm gonna put you on here I'm gonna rip all my bedding off put this balance thing on and then we'll just hopefully make sure it looks nice and then I need to find some stuff on Urban because the rug I've been waiting for is actually out of stock so I need to find something else. Final update of the day. Well, not final day. In conclusion to the last clip, we're going to hospital because Freya does in fact need a leg amputated. So, the Uber's here. Got a blast. Safety first, kids. Oh, it's a really nice day as well. Really nice day to break your ankle. Your we will do. We'll Thank you. Worry. Give us some cuddles when we get out. Come on. We've arrived at the hospital. Freya, there's a chef waiting for you. 
Off to the x-ray room, sisters. <laughs> Like I look and gross, so I'm gonna put this beanie on to um, hide that. Or does that just make it worse? I don't know. We're dealing with it. Anyway, hi everyone. It is currently 12:25 in the evening, which is why I'm whispering because everyone is in bed. But um, I was just editing this vlog that you're watching back, and my laptop decided start doing an update so that's always fun it says 38 minutes remaining so i cannot finish editing this vlog i don't even know how much footage i've got i got like eight minutes into editing so i think there's enough footage for it to be like a full vlog i have no idea like what the hell is happening with my vlog channel right now i've also been so stressed about money like i owe my parents so much money and i do not know where the hell I'm gonna get it from. It's just stressful. I never realised how like much stress just knowing that you've got to pay your own bills and you've got to buy your own food shopping. Like I did that all last year, but I didn't pay my bills myself. Wow, thanks laptop. I all my bills are included last year, so like I don't know. I've just been stressed, but everything's sorted now. I think we've sorted everything. I just need to work my ass off in order to pay my parents back and then I will be on top of everything. I just want to be not in debt. I don't want to owe anyone money. I just want to study. I want to get good grades and I just want to live my life happily and just pretend it's all a dream. I'm going to end this vlog here. If you enjoyed it, please do smash a big thumbs up and I will chat to you in the morning when I can be a little bit louder than I am being right now because I don't want to wake everyone up. Good night.